Ferret Fiend, Helpy Helper Tennis, taken by a Fey Mood. Good thing is, I did just get done building a whole bunch of coffins I can go place. And I even moved to the graveyard, so they won't be going here anymore. Ferret Fiend grabs a uh, carpenter's workshop. Awesome. Tells Darcy was eyeing the, the dwarf nervously as he approached. She had that look. Like he wanted to build something. And she didn't want to give up the, uh, the craft shop there. Or he. Whatever tells Darcy is. A dwarf. That's all that really matters. Can't we come together? Grab all the wood you need. I think we've got a decent amount. That is our current wood stockpile. Close to the ramps. And who's training their sword skill? Pasakoi 2 is training. Barry Axe is um, going through physical therapy, training with a sword. His lungs still screwed up. We pump fluid out of out of it weekly. Mr. Insane 2 says he's not going to be taken out by a, a mood this time and is practicing his dodging. M. Wazer is at the rock ball court shooting some hoops. And a thief almost made it in and to steal something. There he goes. Get him. Sick him. The dog chases off. And our possessed friend doesn't even notice. He just continues on his way. You keep your cool, ferret fiend. Make us an item worthy of praise. Oh, the hospital is filled up. Dang it. Let's cancel all studies. Cancel all studies. Hang on. Train surgery is done with, and read diagnostic tomes. Now it's time for the doctor to put his skills to work. So who do we have here? Brandon Gaming, you're, yeah, whatever. Dion 2, you're unconscious. Looks like your left lung injury, left true rib. There's Master Azra, unconscious. You've just got a small wound, it looks like. Right upper leg injury. 24 volunteers, you're just snoozing in here, maybe. Um, game bug finder. I am worried about you. What happened here? No health problems, no wounds, diagnosis required. What's this say? Your upper spine is broken. Yep. That's going to be a problem. Um, P10-1. How about you? Your health? You took a nice um, cup shot there. And your upper arm is dented. Your right upper arm is dented. Oh, you'll be fine. You just enjoy your day on medical. And who do we have here? Rocco 1. Right lower leg is fractured. Right lower leg is torn open. His lower body is torn open. You're dripping fluids all over the place. And Ferret Fiend is feeling inspired by the recent battle and bloodshed. Finally gathers all the resources he needs and begins a mysterious construction. Yeah, I, I do have a bunch of cage traps here, you'll see. I think the enemy so far will probably just dance between them and mock me. Um, and I'm still tempted to remove all of the ramps that lead to the outside world. The only reason I haven't is because of trading. I still feel there might be something valuable we could get from the outside world. We won't be getting any more migrants for a, a while until more of them die. I do have it hard capped at 45 right now. So, we'll see what happens. Mm, expanding the tunnels down here. Was it early spring? I guess we could get ready, provided the military hills up, to come through this wall, so... Don't be surprised if we're sealed off from the outside world when I come back and we're getting ready to focus on the caverns for a while. I'd, I'd kind of like to um, go down there, get as many ore, as much ore as we can, and build an arsenal of good good armor and strong weapons made out of the hardest materials known to man and mine as deep as we can go trying to find the the magma ocean at the center of the earth hooray ferret fiend has uh, finished his creation here helpy helperton has created Lurthithigigigigan, Rigoth Lease, the Cork Tree Bin. <laughs> Wonderful. Um, 
Yep, so that's that. Let's take a better look at it then. Tangled Flu, the craft of kissing, a cork tree bin. This is a cork tree bin. All crafts dwarfship is of the highest quality. This object menaces with spikes of alder and fine pewter. On the item is an image of deaths and cork tree. On the item is an image of Naglak, the deity of caverns and mountains. Depicted as a male stone dwarf and a dwarf in obsidian. The dwarf is prostrating itself before Nagalak. I guess I'll have to change the um, initial as the any settings and see if we can get the full story on that, find out which dwarf it's specifically about. I'd like to know who's prostrating themselves before that god and exactly why there's a picture of deaths on there. Well, I guess I can imagine it somehow relates to our deaths here. Our catacombs are becoming quite full. Make this one. Toggle all these on. Let's place a few more coffins, shall we? Where are we going to do it? How about some coffins in this room? We'll just line the wall with them. I'm sure they'll be filled up eventually. Whose bodies do we have here? Onal Tustavols and Dark Child One. Well, rest in peace, you two. Hopefully someday we can raise another mage to lead our army. Someone who doesn't feel like burning down the world. You didn't get to burn too much before the rain god showed up and put out your rage. Try and go pick up his gear. Haul it back to base so that someone else can wear it and die in it. Well, just a rainy day around the fort right now. Not a whole lot going on. A couple people are unhappy from the death and destruction that went on earlier. Lockman 1's unhappy. Um, our butcher, Blind Chaos 2, is unhappy down there. I've tried giving pets to everybody that's unhappy. I've assigned most of the war dogs, I think. Yep, no no more animals left. Tells Darcy you don't have one. M. M. Vazer, you don't have one. Mean Melter, you don't have one. A lot of people still don't have um, a pet guardian war dog. I'm gonna try to remedy that problem over over the course of this year. It's ninth slate mid spring, and we're just settling in still. Let's see. Our farm looks like a disaster. Cappy Anon, you've adopted another kitten. Quit purring on me, you damn cat. Go away. Throw you down the mine shaft here. Oops. How far how are we doing here on our little digging? I'm trying to widen the um, stairwell down a little bit. I'm probably gonna have rooms that branch off of some of these, like a, a jail cell, a prison. I'd also like to have some type of small fighting arena. Nothing as um, grand as bitten labor, though. I guess we got a whole bunch of plants growing down here. Can I gather these? Gather plants. Yep, I can gather some of them. What do we have? Shrub, shrub, shrub. I guess the stuff that you gather after you gather it, that's when it changes into seeds and plants that you can possibly use. We do got a farmer's workshop here, so I'm processing our pigtails. It looks like 24 volunteers is there right now. How's our steel doing? We only have 10 drink left. I'm not making any more barrels just yet. I think I need a whole bunch more for our food stockpiles and everything. But I don't have I don't have the logs for it. This thing right here, the rock grinder. Hmm make worthless rocks or grind up the worthless rocks I've had it set to make rock tip bolts and arrows how are our ammunition stockpiles at 361 ammo copper bolts we got a few of those gargoyle bone bolts plenty of wooden bolts those just make the beast lay there and puke they're not very good at finishing it off unless you get a lucky shot bronze moon bronze Bronze Jagged, Cobalt Jagged. I don't think I made those. 
probably recovered them from one of the evil races, the orcs or goblins that passed through. Who's training? Piton 1 is training his sword play, and Box McCloud 2 is training his dodging. There goes Metal Slime Hunt 2, our brave stout hunter. I've turned off everyone's hunting for now. Who's fighting? Face Puncher Apex Origin is sparring with Tilla. Where are they at? They must be right here. And there's Dion, Jello Snark, there's Rocco. I'd like to watch them spar and fling each other around the um around the barracks. There's Jake Dog, Doubt Pride. There's Apex. And he's fighting on top of Tilla. So if you see my arrow there, my courser. They're fighting and sparring right there. Let's see what the chat log says. The logistics counter strikes. Tilda throws a punch at the face puncher, but it's blocked. Hits in the right upper leg, lightly tapping the target, glancing off to the side. Apex Origin is stunned. They collide together and fall over. Apex stands up and taps Tilda on the right lower leg with the wrought iron short sword glances off. Just a training blow. Um, this altar of war here, we can sacrifice a weapon to it, so let's do that. We'll sacrifice one weapon. I have no idea what it does. I didn't want to try it earlier because I didn't have enough weapons, I thought, to comfortably throw one away. Stray donkey gives birth to the donkey foal. Anyone taking this job yet? No. I guess it takes a weapon and causes a reaction, turns it into something else for us. Maybe gems, maybe a pile of gold? Don't really know. They can take one of those rock swords that we've made. I still don't feel confident behind them. Just a lazy, rainy day around the vault, around the fort. Well, I guess I'll wait for someone to take that altar job and sacrifice the weapon. And we'll see what it brings. I may not have the correct job for it. It doesn't say it needs anything. We do not have a priest enabled. Please enable your priestly skills. 